Asterisk. Asterisk and footnotes. An asterisk is played after all punctuation except one. The asterisk is used before a dash. Asterisk can be used as bullet points. The following list shows other uses for an asterisk. Computer science, economics, genetics, mathematics. Please write a complete sentence and make a grocery list. I like this workbook because it's interactive. I don't want you to just repeat what I say. Create your own sentence. Creative writing, that's where it's at. Asterisk and less impressive. An asterisk marks a circumstance that makes it less impressive. Baseball player Roger Maris set a new home run, home run record in 1961. Now, Mr. Maris played 162 games, however, Mr. Ruth, Babe Ruth, played only 154 games. Asterisk and disputes. Another use for an asterisk in sports is to dispute when a player used performance-enhancing drugs. Losers. Mark McGuire's 70 home runs in 1998 set a new record. No, he didn't. He, he got said it was creatine in his locker, but he's using drugs, the cheater. Asterisk and censor. An asterisk can be used to omit letters from offensive words. Uh, the word jerk, I, I don't use that type of language around children. There's much harsher words, but Lance Armstrong is a jerk. Uh, he's actually much worse than that. Uh, yeah, definitely check out the file I have on asterisk because I, you know, if players use performance-enhancing drugs, no, I don't approve of it. But the way uh, Mark McGuire, Lance Armstrong, even worse, uh, actually, uh, the worst was, uh, read the file. You'll see the female athlete who I have no respect for. The, possibly the biggest liar in sports. Asterisk and advertisement. Advertisers use an asterisk as a disclaimer say they're not legally responsible for something. No money down for 12 months, asterisk, and then they'll put the disclaimer at the bottom. This workbook gets uh, my five-star recommendation because it's an interactive workbook where it teaches the rules and allows you for your own creative writing. But what puts over the top is a story I wrote here about punctuation. And the character Quincy the question mark is my favorite character I've ever created. So hopefully uh, this, these uh, videos on punctuation will inspire you to look at my files and teach your students. And if you can't afford this workbook, just buy a, buy a spiral bound notebook and make your own sentences. Great reference guide for the rest of your life.